the transport system is very well prepared to ensure that the Olympic Games are a fantastic success and that we keep London and the rest of the UK moving at the same time. Some £6.5 billion has been invested in transport infrastructure to boost capacity for the Games and very detailed operational plans have now been developed to make sure that during that Games period uh, London continues to operate effectively as does the rest of the country. There will be some transport hotspots but we'll manage those and the transport system is extraordinarily resilient. We have a, a, a tube system which will operate very well, we have a bus system which will operate very well and we have extra services which are being laid on over the Games period. So yes, the transport system will cope and London will be very much open for business. Businesses can do a lot to prepare uh, to enable their staff to be able to get to and from work and from their suppliers to be able to deliver freight and goods and so on. One of the key things that I would say is come and look at our website where there is detailed information about the way in which the road network will operate during the Olympics and the way the public transport system will operate. And that's very granular information which will enable businesses to think about maybe allowing people to go home early one day or work a bit later to avoid some of the transport hotspots. London's transport system will operate very well, but there are some hotspots spot, hot that we need to manage around, both on the roads um, and on public transport, but London will be very much open for business. There has been a great deal of focus, and is a great deal of focus at TfL, on improving traffic flow. Uh, we manage the road network in a very dynamic way and a lot of investment has been made in new technology to enable us to manage traffic signals and things like that in a different and more dynamic way. In addition, we've been pressing for a lane rental scheme uh, with the CBI support, which will give us uh, much greater uh, leverage to manage roadworks in a more effective way and keep disruptive roadworks to an absolute minimum.